Hey YouTube and welcome back to Diva Styles. In this video, I'm pretty much going to be showing you how I cut um, my images and pretty much to transfer them over and print out stickers. So, as you can see, this is the Silhouette Studio that I'm in. You can do this one or two ways, but you guys already know my all-time program that I love is Publisher. So, I'm going to actually insert the font, um, my text that she uh, requested in here. Um, they didn't have a specific font that they wanted, but... I don't think nobody wants just regular text either. I believe she's putting these on um, some glasses. I'm also not trying to do no hard font either. Something that makes it hard for me to, um, them S's is terrible. Uh, something hard for me to pull up. Cause y'all know I'm not with that. <laughs> All right, let's see what this look like. But um, if you don't want to, you do not have to use a program to um. But I don't look bad. I'm just, I'm just gonna do this. Um, you can just straight create your uh your font or your image straight into silhouette. You do not have to do what I'm doing. Then I'm just going to save this as a picture. I'm just weird and like doing things the difficult way. Easy to me, but probably difficult to you. So um, I'm just going to name this that. All right. So let's go on over to Silhouette. And uh, y'all, I am burning up. Let me tell y'all. My AC has not been working. This man's supposed to be here in 20 minutes. Burning up. All right, let me see. Okay, where is it at? Sipping. Okay, here we go. Then you just go ahead and insert it. And as you see, it is there. And, um, over here on the side, as you see, you have many options, uh, but you want to click on the one that looks like a butterfly to me. It'll say open the trace panel and then uh, select trace area. And you just want to highlight everything that you got. And then um, you see the difference? Uh, solid fill or um, outline. Those are your two choices. I always do solid fill. And then you just want to go down here and go to trace. And as you see, it has pretty much cut it. I was able to pull this away. So this is pretty much what you are going to be printing. That's what's going to cut in your machine. And if I look right, it looks like it combined it. Shoot, that's a win-win for me on uh, cutting these things out. That is a... That's a, why should I go ahead and do, let me see what it look like if I do the outline. Let's see. I'm going I'm to try, I'm going to try something different. Let's see what it look like if we do the other one. Let's do the outline. Now trace. Let's see what that looks like. It looks the same. What different? Okay. Anywho, uh, that's pretty much how you do it. Uh, not too hard, not too difficult at all. Uh, I will probably change this font because it blended together in a way that just did not sit well with me. All right, let's try that. Save this picture. Yes, override it. Okay, now let's go back to the silhouette. Let's go ahead and uh, open that up. Add that on in here. Okay, here we go. We got this in here. Let's go back to the butterfly looking thing. Select trace area. Go ahead, highlight it. 
Let's trace. Pull it apart. Okay, that looks a little bit better because it's cursive. But I can go ahead and stretch this out as far or as much as I need to. Um, that looks great to me. That looks awesome. Um, I'm going to go ahead and cut this, but I'm going to go ahead and in stop the video now, and then I'll do the cutting process in another video, just so they're not too long. But if you have any questions on pretty much this process, uh, let's go in, go on ahead and add an image in here. Shoot, let's get bad and bougie. Let's, let's see what it look like. All right, let's add this 70s thing up in here. Okay. How would you cut this? Let's see. Because you know you can do this with images as well. Let's put that on. Go back to the butterfly. Select trace area. Go ahead and cover this thing. Trace. And bam, look at that. That is, that's awesome. And that could be something that you put on a shirt, um, a purse, anything. But uh, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and stop it. I'm starting to drag on. If you have any questions at all, please feel free to ask. And as always, I will see you guys very soon. Bye.